Hello, my friends, and welcome back to the show that never ends. I'm Rod, I'm your happy hippie, and I'm outside enjoying this beautiful afternoon. It's a gorgeous day here in East Tennessee, and I'm out having a delicious red eye. I've got the creek behind me. I don't know if you could hear it. This is so nice. My dog's running around. Just a beautiful day. And this is a video to announce a contest I'm having. Um, contest, a very simple one, with a twist to it. A little bit of a twist to it. Um, I recently hit like 420 subs, and I like that number, 420. Um, happens to be my address. It's just a cool number, 420. Uh, so I thought I'd do a video to uh, celebrate it and to say thank you. Um, thank you to the VC for accepting me, for the people who watch my videos and comment on them, people who support my channel. I thank you to all the people who make videos, the channels that I watch. Uh, VC is a great community. I'm glad to be part of it. And this is just a, a contest to say thank you. Um, like I said, it's a simple contest with a twist. Um, I was going to do it back in February when I hit 350, but there was a lot of contests going on, and I put it off. You know, March, the craziness, and April, I just kind of let every, I just, I didn't worry about it. Um, I just found out yesterday I'm going back to work Friday, uh, which is, I think, May 7th, which is great. The antique store is opening back up for business. Um, that's another reason I'm excited, so it's, it's just a good time right now. Um, and I don't want to be one of those channels that have a contest to push to get to a certain number. Not that there's anything wrong with that. This isn't pushing to get to whatever. This is just a thank you for supporting my channel. And because I hit 420, that magic number. Um, video simple. But there is a twist. The first part of the video, I guess it's four parts. I want you to throw a shout out to your local record store. So I'm going to go Lost and Found, Knoxville, Tennessee. They're on Broadway in Knoxville. The owners are wonderful people. Staff is great. Another local record shop that's not local to me, but... Yeah, I believe he's in North Carolina. Noble Records, independent record store. We all know Noble Records. Dylan has a great channel, and I'd love a chance to get to his store. So throw a shout-out to a local record store. Um, I really believe in supporting local business. Number one, because I work at a mom-and-pop store, an antique shop. I have a booth there, plus I work at the coffee shop on weekends. Um, so I really believe in supporting local business. So throw that shout out. And also, I want you to show your recent vinyl purchase or recent vinyl find. Mine would be the Kinks, or the Village Green Preservation Society. And this is a classic album, arguably the best album they did. And I saw Randy Weaver a few months back do a video on the box set of this album, and it looked amazing. But I just settled for this, and I got it for nothing because I went down to Lost and Found because they opened up Friday, and I had like four or five albums, and uh, I traded. Uh, fair, fair and square, just straight up trade. So it was unopened brand new copy. I didn't bring the album out with me because I'm outside. I didn't want it to get damaged, but it's 180 gram vinyl. Beautiful copy. So that's my most recent vinyl purchase or recent vinyl find. The second one is in honor of my wife, Kelly, who uh, I love to death, but she will not get on camera with me. She won't do it, but she is a, a bookworm, a book nut. And she's always encouraging me, you need to read more. You need, while you're listening to the damn album, read a book. Read a book. That's all I hear from this woman. Um, so show a book. But not just any book. I want you to show an autobiography or a biography about a band or artist or a book 
that one of your favorite musicians has written. Tyler, it could even be about music. It could be a, a, a fiction book about, you know, a fictional musical character or whatever. But I'm choosing this. This is Steve Earle. This is a fiction book, a novel that Steve Earle wrote. Steve Earle is one of my favorite singer-songwriters. And uh, you like this book. What would you give this, Kelly? Out of five stars. Four and a half stars. Um, really fun read, Steve Earle. Um, so, shout out to your local record store. Your most recent find or purchase, a book about music. It could be a biography, an autobiography, or a book written by your favorite musician. So, and the other thing I want you to show is a video. So we got album, book, video. The video's got to be about music. This was VCLT from Eric Weinbender. Big Eric. I love this. I, I, I probably play this once every two weeks. I'll fall asleep to it, man. And it's wonderful from 1989, July 4th, Shuffle Off to Buffalo. Show some type of DVD, it could even be VHS about music, either a documentary about music or a movie about like Johnny Cash, Walk the Line. So I want a movie, music related, your most recent purchase, and the book we talked about. Of course, the shout out to your local record store. Now here's the twist. Here's the twist. Um, I want you to nominate somebody to win the prize. And by making the video, you automatically get your name thrown in the hat. So you're still gonna, your, your name's still gonna be in the hat for the contest, but you must nominate somebody in the VC to win and tell me why you're nominating that person. And I wanna give credit where credit due. Beth at B-Sides, oh, a couple weeks ago, I had made a comment on a video or something about coming up with a good idea for a contest and she kind of suggested this how about letting the winner pick the winner and so she told me feel free to borrow it so I'm putting my own uh, twist to it so that's it so if you make a video you, you get your name in the hat the person who you nominate gets their name in the hat someone nominates you you're in twice I don't care if you get nominated ten times you're going to get 10 names in the hat, 10 chances of winning. I don't even care if you don't make a video, but someone nominates you. You're going to get a chance to win this. And it's just a great big thank you to everybody in the VC for being supportive. Um, I think it's a, two years in October, so about a year and a half I've been doing this. Solely just for fun. I did it one night on a whim. I think my daughter talked me into doing it. So, that's my contest. Um, oh, yeah, what do you win? A $33 gift card to Amazon, as in 33 RPM. So, you could win it. You may uh, nominate somebody who ends up winning it. So, you never know. Peace, guys. Be good to each other. You know, this whole thing hopefully is coming to an end soon. I know most of the country is opening back up. Like I said, I'm going back to work next Friday, and I can't wait to get back out there. So cheers and peace and be good to each other.